It's tough, you know, it's kind of, honestly, I'm kind of in shock a little bit, you know, just, you don't prepare yourself for this outcome. You know, everything in your preparation, in your mind is, we're going to win this game. You know, you don't really even think of the other side. So when it hits, it hits hard. Um, I love this team. I love these guys. I love the way we competed this year. Um, I love wait, playing with them week in and week out. And it hurts. It hurts. You just you feel the pain across the locker room. You know, think how far we've come and then to, to really come up short from what our end goal was. It hurts. It's sudden. It hurts. It's going to take a while to get over. Will it, will it take a while maybe to also appreciate maybe what this team was able to accomplish or maybe the, the ending just kind of overrides some of those emotions? Right now, just the ending kind of overrides it. Eventually, you know, we'll be able to, to take a step back and, and look at the season on the whole and what we were, were able to accomplish and, and how far we came. But personally, right now, it just it hurts pretty bad. And uh, you know we're so close, a few plays away from uh, from being where we wanted to be, and uh, today we just didn't make enough plays. Yeah, I don't think they did a whole lot differently. Uh, they just came out and and unfortunately they stopped us on a couple drives. You know we knew coming in that we were gonna have to score points. Obviously high powered offense on the other side. Defense has done a great job. Uh, all, all postseason for us, but we had a ton of respect uh, for, for what this team could do on the offensive side of the ball. So new coming in that we we're going to have to score, and, uh, you know, we just, we just didn't score enough points. A little bit of pressure on the offense that way. As you mentioned, it's almost as if you had to keep scoring, touchdown, touchdown, in order to keep pace. What do you think with them? I mean, that's week in and week out is, you know, uh, you want to score every time you touch it. You know, obviously that's not the case, but that's our mindset. It's not, hey, go out and get a couple first downs. It's go out and, and find a way to get this thing in the end zone. So, um, yeah, we knew once they got rolling a little bit on the offensive side that every possession was key. Uh, and, and unfortunately, we didn't we didn't take advantage of every possession like we needed to. With the way this season played out for you guys, are your hopes to come back and be this team's quarterback long term? Yeah, I'll have to take a step back and. and Look at things here in the off season. Obviously, uh, I love this team. I love what this team was able to accomplish. Uh, a lot of, a lot of love for for the guys on this team and, and love playing with them. So, um, I will take a step back and look at that. But right now, it's uh, just really can't can't think about anything but but how close we were and 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 this loss. A lot of times for a quarterback, to success, that relationship with your OC has to be there. How has that relationship uh, evolved, and where is it at now? How, how close are you and Coach Smith? We're great. You know, I, I love Art. I have a ton of respect for what he's done this year, uh, being a, a first-year play caller and, and how he's gone about things, his consistency week in and week out, and his process of, uh, of getting ready for the game. Our communication is great. You know, we, we spend a lot of time together going over the game plan and, and just talking through different things and uh, ways we want to attack and possible adjustments we can make. So. You know, a ton of love for Art and, and really proud of how he's progressed throughout the year as a play caller and, and definitely a lot of confidence in him moving forward in his career. As the year wore on, did you feel you and him just starting to share a brain, so to speak, but like you were on the same page as far as money? No doubt. You know, the, the more time you spend together, uh, the more games you play together and, and, and hear the calls come in, you know, you kind of know exactly what he's wanting to get out of a play call and, and his mindset. And uh, yeah, I think the more time we were together, the, the closer we got and, and uh, you know, the more and more on the same page and kind of synergistic we were. Were you impressed with their ability to slow Derek? They did a good job. You know, I think uh, we knew coming in that their front was, was good up front. They could move, uh, get some penetration and, and create some problems. Uh, Derek had some nice runs. You know, I, I don't think they, they stopped him by any stretches, kind of the way Second half played out. We had to kind of get away from it a little bit and and throw it a little bit more. But uh, I've taken a step back and, and look at the tape and see exactly what they did. I know they did a good job on a, on a couple of drives in a row of of limiting us to. Uh, I think we had a, a first and five, and then end up getting uh, 
two one yard or no yard runs on on second and one and third and one. So obviously they did something there, something there well, and uh, and it's rare to to stop two two when when you only got one yard to get. So you have to give a ton of credit for them. They they found a way to to slow them down a little bit and uh, you know paid off for them. I don't think they did anything particularly today. Um, I had him on, on a should have been a touchdown on uh, on one play there right before play before I threw it to Ferk should have been a touchdown to AJ. He ended up winning on the outside, uh, so he did a good job for us. He got open when when his number was called, and uh, I don't think they did anything in particular to stop him. You know, he he did what all he could do and with the situation he was given. Last one. No doubt, you know, I think that we started something special here. Uh, a lot of belief in one another and, and what we can do when we buy in and and uh, believe in each other and uh, and play together. And we did that throughout the whole season. So, yeah, like I said, I love playing with these guys, and I think uh, I think they feel the same way.